Hi teacher. We are learning about Pythagorean theorem from so long. What are its uses? This is a very good question. So, first we will start with Pythagorean theorem. Is? The Pythagorean theorem states that the sum of the squares of the legs of a right triangle, that is a square plus b square, is the same as the square of its hypotenuse, that is c square. Now let's see where we are actually using it in real life. The Pythagorean theorem can be used in numerous ways, for example, even on a baseball stadium. Since the bases are each 90 feet apart in the form of a square, the theorem helps us to find the distance the catcher has to throw the ball to get to second base when a runner is trying to steal. The right triangle formed would be with half of the infield where the legs of the triangle are the base parts of 90 feet each and the hypotenuse is from the home plate to second base. The hypotenuse can be found by solving the equation 90 square plus 90 square equals c square. That is, solving c will show us that the throw is about 127.3 feet. This information is useful because it will give the coaches an idea about how hard the catcher needs to be able to throw a ball accurately in order to throw a runner out. Pythagoras theorem can also be used even in the case of mountains. The horizontal and vertical distances from the foot of the mountain to its top can be determined on a map, forming the legs of a right triangle that can be drawn in the mountain center. The third side of the triangle, the hypotenuse, represents the walk of the mountain, which never has to be physically measured since it can be found using the Pythagorean theorem. Painters use ladders to paint on high buildings and often use the help of Pythagoras theorem to complete their work. The painter needs to determine how tall a ladder he needs to be in order to safely place the base away from the wall so it won't tip over. In this case, the ladder itself will be the hypotenuse. The painter has to put the base of the ladder 2 meter away from the wall to ensure it won't tip. What will be the length of the ladder required by the painter to complete his work? You can calculate it using Pythagoras theorem. 3 square plus 2 square is equal to c square that is 9 plus 4 equal to c square so root 13 equal to 6 that is 3.6 meters. Thus, the painter will need a ladder at least about 3.6 meters high. The visible distance to a horizon can be found with the Pythagorean theorem given that the radius of the earth is 6380 kilometers. Inside a 100 meter tall lighthouse, a night watchman or the coast guard may be interested in the distance a ship is from the shore when seen at the horizon, forming a right triangle into the center of it, as shown here. The viewing distance inside the top of the lighthouse is the solution to the equation which comes about to be a value of over 35 kilometers in this case. So today we had learned about Pythagoras theorem and its real life application.